What do we have here? You have three amazing bottles, Larry. Yeah. This looks really good. I brought um, a little bit of a little bit of everything for kind of all people. Um, I brought a dry rosé because, well, these are just extremely popular right yeah, now. Yeah, for sure. Um, and of course, it's it's summertime, and people are going to be drinking more and more rosé. Most definitely. So uh, this is this is a a rose. It's a dry rosé. Okay. Um, you know, so I like that. It's got a really nice crispness. It kind of drinks like a white wine, but it's got you know great mm -hmm. uh, um, you know bright flavors and nice. everything. Nice. Yeah. Perfect for this time. Oh yeah, perfect. It's Seventy-five degrees. You know, we're getting to that that time of year. That's great. Yep. And then uh, I brought a Cabernet Franc, which is uh, one of the I think the best best um, Bordeaux varieties that grows here in New Jersey really well. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, we're, we're really, really proud of the Cabernet Franc we've made. This is my speed right here. Yeah. This is my baby. So yeah. if you like Bordeaux, um, this this would be the wine you'd go to nice. from Charret. Um, of course, we do Cabernet Sauvignon and, and Merlot as well, but uh, Love it. this is probably one of my, my flagships as far as uh, a, a red wine goes. What's your go-to if you had to choose? Uh, it's hard because these are like your children. These are your exactly, babies. So yeah. like, do you have a favorite child? It, it, you know, honestly, for me, it's all about wine is food. Yeah. So if, if I'm drinking something, it's all about what am I eating with it. Gotcha. So, um, but Perfect I mean, if caring. I'm just going to sit on the patio in the summertime and drink something, it's going to be the rosé. Nice. Uh, you know, but it, what's become popular, which I think is very interesting, is actually chilled red wines in really? the summertime. So yeah. if you're a red wine drinker. I am. And, and you're like, ah, I'm not going to do the white wines. I'm just not going to do right. it. Um, you can always chill the red wine. Don't make it refrigerator temperature. You know, make right. it like maybe, you know, 60 degrees, okay. 65 degrees. That. So it's like a little um, bit more refreshing. It's like a little more refreshing. Gotcha. It, it actually brings out some of the acidity, so it's kind of the things you would like in the summertime. Gotcha. That yeah. makes sense. So it's, it's interesting. Um, you know, the, the purists will be like, oh my god, don't suggest that. But <laughs> yeah. it's become popular doing? doing that. Yeah. Um, and then, of course, I brought a summer sangria, and this is, this nice. is for, you know, any of our, our friends who really like, you know, that, something sweet. Um, right. We serve this over ice. You can put a slice of lime in it. Uh, Can't it's, go wrong. No, it's fantastic. It's wonderful. So do you want to try one? We'll chat about wine yeah, in our sure. upcoming event. Which one sure. uh, do you want to go to first? Well, I mean... Dealer's choice. Let's, uh, since you like the Cab Franc, we can uh, open this one first, nice. and then, of course, we can try... You're buttering me up. This is great. <laughs> uh, Sherrett Winery, we uh, are so excited to have you guys on board for our big event down in Derby Wine Festival, and you, Larry, are going to be on hand, right? May yes. 4th? Mm -hmm. Cooper River, which is such a, a beautiful, uh, you know, backdrop for this for this day. Yeah, it's a beautiful um, place to have a festival. Yeah, are you gonna wear some like derby gear? Are you gonna get all uh, decked out? Uh, well, I don't know. I gotta do some shopping, yeah, I guess. Do some shopping. <laughs> yeah, hop on Amazon. You get some stuff delivered. But uh, yeah. we're really excited. All the best South Jersey wineries. We can learn about uh, betting on the ponies. Do you do any sports betting and stuff like that? Uh, you know, start? I have before. Oh, you have. You okay. know, but uh, I'd be certainly interested to learn from the pros. Right. Yeah. You know? <laughs> Um, so I've been learning about this, Larry. So if I screw up, don't judge me. But I'm ah, you like that? There you go. There yeah. you go. You know, for for I'm uh, like petrified though. Like I'm I know, right? Shaking, like dump it on someone. <laughs> yeah. the, this uh, looks cool, right? If you want to, if you want to learn how to do this and not look stupid, <laughs> yes, please put a, show put me, Larry. Put a flat on the table. Yeah. And go around. Nice. See how much easier it is. It's so much easier. Yep. Are we at the sipping part? We are. Yes. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers, Larry. <laughs> And it's really nice. Oh yeah, this is gonna be my favorite. Mm. This is really good. So will this be on hand for the event? Will you have this? Uh, yeah, we usually, we usually bring um, at least a few uh, dry reds. Just for me, you know, and then for, for other people. Too. Yeah, That's exactly. Awesome Just for you. For <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I'm gonna need it. This is really good. I can't stop. South Jersey. We have good soil here. We have great soil. We have for, great soil. Yeah. Take that, Napa. We got good soil. What now? Uh, Larry Sherritt, thank you so much for coming by and uh, yeah, drinking some wine with me before noon. This is fantastic. My show today is going to be very interesting right. later on. It's going to be great. Right. Uh, it's better than day drinking. It's morning drinking. Uh, morning drinking. What could be better <laughs> than that? Uh, you're fantastic. Thank you so much, man. Thank you so much. Uh, May 4th, it's going to be a great day. Down in Derby Wine Festival, Cooper River Park with Sherritt Winery. Uh, we can't wait. Thanks we so much. We hope to see you there. Appreciate it. Thank you. Well,